Internet of Things. And the Internet of Things is a connected network of systems, software, technologies, and other data in order to exchange and be connected with the world today. My research question is, to what extent does Amazon's Alexa negatively affect the life skills of children ages four to eight in Maryland? My claim is that Amazon's Alexa is harmful to developing life skills among young children. Why? Because it first deteriorates relationships between family members, second challenges interpersonal development, and three corrupts learning abilities. My solution for this contains two parts. First part is to insert a new algorithm which will only allow Alexa to respond to the request given if used please and thank you. So instead of saying, hey Alexa, you have to say, hey Alexa, please. Um, and this will ensure that um, kids develop um, good manners. My second part is to install a kids mode which censors inappropriate topics such as sexual content so that parents can decide when they'd like to sit down their children and talk about that with their kids. My limitations for the solution is that it would have to be installed into all new Amazon Alexas and Echoes instead of the ones that families currently have. Now, my first reason is that Amazon's Alexa is damaging relationships between kids and parents because kids are being involuntarily wired to go to, um, to, go to Alexa instead of their parents to ask questions. Um, as you can see in the graph here, Amazon's Alexa is the leading voice assailant in family homes. And right now, 100, 157 million um, families have Alexa currently in their home. Um, okay. Uh, according to the Washington Post by Rosenwald, children certainly enjoy Alexa's company referring, oh, wrong time. Okay. Um, according to Richard Fried, you can yell at it and demand entertainment whenever you want, and that encourages rudeness and lack of manners. Also, on the account of PhD psychologist Susan Pinker, acquiring communication skills means eye contact and reading facial expressions, and Alexa can't provide that. So, it ruins the ability to develop essential social skills. Amazon's Alexa corrupts learning ability because it makes it easier for students to cheat. Especially now in 2020, because of the pandemic, um, a lot of young students, K through five, are being um, doing school from home, and they uh, Alexa is an easy tool to just ask um, answers to classwork tests, homework, um, because everything's online teachers won't be able to notice if they're cheating. And this will deplete children's motivation to learn because they're like, they don't have to think. They can just ask Alexa and know the answer automatically. Um, this graph shows the units behind Amazon's Alexa and how it's increased throughout the years by Statistica. All in all, Amazon's Alexa creates disadvantageous effects on children's four to eight. If we want to ensure that our future generation contains social skills, communication skills, um, emotional intelligence, and good learning skills, we need to ensure that we would um, put limitations on Alexa in order to make sure that their future is in good hands. Thank you for your time. Do you have any questions? I do have two, oh. I do have two questions for you. As you went through the entire process, so from the very beginning to today, tell me how your research question evolved. Ooh, okay. So at first, I wanted to just look on the education factor of, you know, Alexa, on like, oh, how can they, like, how does that ruin their learning abilities? But as I researched, I found that there wasn't a lot of, like, data or information for evidence on that, and it was more, like, general, like, life skills. And that, you know, became in parts that includes education and, you know, uh, relationships with people, stuff like that. Okay, and if you had more time, what additional research would you uh, would you do? I would probably look into other voice-activated assistants like Siri or Google Home, not just uh, Amazon's Alexa, because um, you know, what if some of those already had kids modes or stuff like that? That you know, that would change the way that this process would have gone.